Allora, never use hot water, always cold. There is a bit of a trick. You will fill the base when you're making your coffee and there has to be a bit of a rim of water that is coming out. Uh, you don't want the coffee to be too strong. If there isn't enough water, you can add. I actually, I'm basically coating my base where I'm gonna put my espresso. So I either buy Illy coffee, I-double-L-Y, it's the best that you can buy at your local grocer. Um, my husband actually ground his own. So I don't know, it's probably like extra strong Colombian. I always use a base, like a plate, a napkin, whatever you have handy. I happen to have this one handy so that if anything overflows, I don't have to worry about the mess of getting coffee grinds. I'm gonna pile it. I'm not gonna flatten. I find that when I flatten, sometimes it's too strong, but create like a little Mount Everest. As you can see, this machine has been with me forever. And make sure it's really tight. My mother always used to do this, but I'm not doing that. Now, I'm gonna turn on my stove to max. Takes a minute. And now it's biscotti time. As you can see, I plated my biscotti. And I'm gonna show you what I like to do before my guests or my girlfriend or me and my hubby sit down to have our coffee. I always have icing sugar ready and I just like to sort of dust it a little. It just kind of makes it look more interesting and actually, I don't know, just more inviting. Food should taste good and look good. Voila. Never let it overboil. Remember, you do not want to have boiling burnt coffee. It's the worst. So this is done. Now you're gonna say, what are you doing, Lisa? So I'm bringing it over here because personally for me, I like to put my sugar. Okay, if you have a guest that doesn't want any sugar, pour their coffee first. But for me, I like a little sugar, but I find that if I put it directly into my machine, and we have a lot of these long spoons, especially for this um, at my house. Uh, it just, I feel that the sugar gets absorbed better and I can use less sugar. So have your spoons ready in case someone needs extra, but I will just do less sugar. And this is like an eight, six to eight cup. And I will put probably three and a half stir it inside the pot mm, there's nothing better coffee for two I'm having my Betsy over my Amica di Cuore we'll probably drink the whole thing we have a lot of catching up to do coffee time <laughs> 